hanging out in northeastern Pennsylvania, solar eclipse 2017, uh, well north of totality in all that area. This region, um, from what I looked up, we're supposed to get like 75% um, hanging out with uh, some beverages with my brother Steve. And it's, uh, it's definitely kind of weird. It's definitely a, a goofy feeling. I mean, there is some decent amount of cloud cover, but the temperature feels as if it's dropped a bit and the crickets seem to be out. I think that's crickets. I know the bugs weren't making a ton of noise uh, not too long ago, and there's definitely a lighting uh, difference, wouldn't you say? I would agree. Um, even though we're not experiencing the totality, I definitely feel a change in uh, the environment. Definitely hearing more crickets coming alive, and uh, I definitely feel coolness in the air. A little bit of a sense of like a late evening kind of feel. Yeah, it's about quarter of three or so. Uh, right now and it definitely it's it's dim lighting I don't know if the camera's doing it justice but from being used to being in this area in the afternoon I mean there's definitely that you know sunset sort of feel it's it's interesting yeah if I wasn't aware that the eclipse was happening today I don't know that I would truly notice I would notice something was off but I would just assume that it was the cloud cover or something along those lines but knowing that it's happening and then kind of uh, paying attention to the environment around you, you can um, tell that something's going on. It's a good reason to uh, take a break from some of the chores and the jobs we're working on and having ourselves uh, a little little beverage. Unfortunately, I uh, did not invest in a pair of Eclipse glasses and don't care to damage my sight. This is about what we're going to experience is just be out here on the hilltop and just kind of just witness what's going on and just look around and I'm looking directly in and I'm not so willing to uh, to chant some of my really good cameras so I have uh, a few of my GoPro set up so if I capture anything cool um, I'll certainly share it but who knows maybe the GoPro lenses won't function as uh, expected after this because I know the uh, the light is definitely bright it's about 10 after 3 on the Eclipse day 2017 and we're past it now. We can definitely feel warming up. The sun's getting brighter, more back to normal. We can feel starting to warm up on our skin. Um, kind of a cool experience. Hopefully next time one comes around, I can get closer and maybe get in the, uh, into the path of totality. So the eclipse is definitely coming to its conclusion. We're getting back to a little more normal light. And, uh, you know, I'm hoping I have a little bit of footage. Hopefully my cameras are still usable. Um, Let's hope there's no lens damage from pointing them directly at the sun. Eclipse 2017 over like that.